artificial intelligence. Now, if you Google it, it says it is a field that combines computer science to enable problem solving sounds. Sounds complicated, right? Well, it is and its limits are even more complicated. We humans created artificial intelligence, but today many of us are falling prey to it. Like, look at this image. Now, by the face of it, you can recognize him as the leader of the Catholic Church. So, why was he? So, why has he ditched his plain white clothes for this weird puffer jacket? Well, he has not. This is the artificial intelligence at play. And if you thought so, you're not alone. The world was fooled by this image as well. For the longest time, people thought the Pope had changed his dressing style. And we can assure you, he has not. Now, should you be worried? Well, given most of us live our practical lives on the internet, this is far too common. Today it was Pope Francis, yesterday it was Donald Trump. There was an image of a former US president being arrested. The image went viral in no time, but there was only one problem, it wasn't real. Applications making these hyper-realistic images are easily available. All you have to do is make one search. But this definitely sparks confusion about what to believe and what not to. For many years now, we have faced the threat of deep fake images of poor people's faces on occasions it has even propagated violence and minor abuse. So this leaves us with another cautionary lesson. And it's clear, you should not believe everything you see on the internet, especially your WhatsApp forwards.